we must strive to push ourselves outside our usual boundaries for us to be able to achieve maximum what? Potential. Are we together? So that is a little about the comfort zone. Now, also importantly, is that uh, we can't make progress by operating in a comfort zone. We must be able to embrace some level of what? Of discomfort. Now, the advantage is lies within the last statement there, which says that when you try challenging tasks, are we together? When you try challenging what? Tasks. These tasks become normal and they become and the, when they become normal, it means that you, uh, you broaden your comfort zone and these activities now become regular what? Activities, all together. For example, when I just bought my treadmill, I would run just one kilometer like this one. And I'm sweating and I'm panting and I'm really very uncomfortable. In fact, my muscles will pain me, all together. Then as I kept on running, the one kilometer became normal. Then I strived for the two kilometers, three kilometers. Now I can do five kilowatt kilometers. Are you getting what I'm telling you? Why? Because your body, you, at the moment you keep on doing hard tasks, then they become normal and it becomes now your new comfort what? zone. Then you can be able to now strive for higher tasks. Are we together? That's why I want to encourage us to double our efforts in whatever we are doing. I don't know what is it that you're doing. It could be within the business or even outside the business. But uh, when we go back to the business, I want us to challenge ourselves to get a new normal. Nowadays, with the COVID-19, they are talking about new normal. Can anyone say new normal? Can anyone say new normal? So the question is, what is your normal? What are those, where, where can you be able to operate and you're feeling what? Comfortable. So I'm going to challenge us to double our activities or triple our activities, or maybe just increase them. I don't know where you are, but surely where you are right now is your own comfort what? Comfort zone. Of course it varies. Maybe for Yaya, her comfort zone is five phone calls. And maybe for Dad Muhir, it's 20 phone calls. Maybe for a person like Karina, it is 30 phone calls. That's her comfort zone, all together. So what we are saying is that don't accept yourself to be so long in your current comfort zone or having a very tiny comfort what? Comfort zone, all together. And maybe it, you could also be able to uh, ask yourself, how am I doing in terms of activity? Some of us, you find that you are called a networker and congratulations to a networker. But you don't do any activity within network what? Marketing. You find that the whole day has passed by and you have not prospected, you have not even gone Facebook. The only time you go to, 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 to status is to look at it and laugh and be entertained by, by different people's, you know, memes and what of you not prospect out together. So many times you find that you are living within a comfort zone but yet you are dreaming big what? Big dreams, out together.